Hello and welcome back and today's Wembley Day. Um, I've had a good look at the map. It's going to be tight. I'm still umming and ahhing. in today. We're going to get into today, though. We are going to build Wembley Park, um, get the Met and the um, Jubilee hooked up to Wembley Park onward to West Hempstead, then obviously down into central London. And um, we'll get that hooked up today. And then we'll have a look at the, the Wembley Stadium station where the Chilton line sort of splits off just before Wembley Park. The biggest problem is, is like we said in the last episode, I don't think we have anywhere where I can actually fit it in. I could fit Wembley Station in, the stadium itself, but it would be turned back. It wouldn't carry on. I think it, then it cross, crosses the West Coast Main Line um, back across uh, a bit shorter. Let's take a look. So, you know... The, the, the problem is, is the gap between here and here ideally should be between here and down here somewhere. And because of the nature of the map and what we've had to fit in, we simply won't be able to get that track in, I don't think. Um, I've, I've even had a look at going, could I just sneak it across here, you know, next to this road? Because that'd be the ideal sort of V kind of split. And then you'd have Wembley Stadium somewhere here. And it'd sort of park and i mean i mean i'm looking at putting wembley station here wembley park i might even have to put that a bit further up have this bend round like this and then bend back and then and then the other side of where we would maybe find something to place is wembley stadium you'd have the wembley stadium station the chilton line and then it has to cross the west coast main line and if we look at what we've got built in here and what we've squeezed into this I don't think we can squeeze anything else in here. Like I said, in an ideal world, this piece of track here, this stretch, this sort of clean stretch needs to be a bigger, extended, maybe to almost about here, then we could have done it here. And then we'd have a lot more space. In an ideal world, what I shouldn't have done is this so big. This should be maybe, I should have shrunk this down because it's kind of unnecessary. Um, it's a bit late now because if I shrink that down, that means move moving the whole map it's built it's done it's built it's finished um we can't do anything about that now so i think the the best case is what we could do is we could have wembley stadium and have a chilton line that just turns back at wembley almost like we'll have our own version of our wembley express service that just goes from wembley back wembley stadium back down to marleybourne so we'll have an express express train that just goes in and out. Maybe just one or two of those just running backwards and forwards there. I think that's the best we can do. The other the other line is going to come past Wembley Park and across here. And this is going to be our main sort of access here. This is the main one I wanted to get in anyway. I'm a little bit gutted. I'm not going to lie. Because um, this kind of crosses... We're looking at Google Maps. This line kind of crosses straight across, which is a real shame. Because it links up a lot of... like. Uh, a lot of boroughs i guess um i'm not liking the way that has to stop so much i'm not sure like i wish I'm, i i have a lot of time and respect for uh those that make timetables with trains because i cannot get anything to run smoothly on here at all at all anyway we're gonna get this connected at least we're gonna get this train station going which already has sort of access to this it also has a bus stop as well so we at least get this going we'll get some met trains turning back on here we'll get some jubilee and met trains stopped at uh, wembley park which would be nice we'll find some sort of asset for wembley stadium i've got to have a look that'll be something i'll do afterwards the main reason for the episode today is to get wembley uh, park station in first um and then whatever i do with wembley stadium and maybe a wembley stadium station I will do in a detail in episode and add that in that, I think. Um, great thing is, is once we get this station in and I get a little bit of the, the Jubilee spinning off this way, we can get detail in. We can fill this, basically. We can fill this space with something. I'm, I'm tempted to get the Wembley Stadium uh, detail in and actually drop a small town here. I'm tempted to do that. I'm not really sure about here. I'm kind of hoping, kind of hoping that this, I'm trying to encourage this to spread to that. I might even do a couple of cheeky like road underpasses here, maybe one tunnel underneath. I'm trying to get this. It's it's, it's growing here and it's 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 invading my warehouses. No, I don't want you to go this way. I want you to go this way. 
Um, I know there is a mod um, that pr can prevent this from happening. I think I sort of almost buy the land, right? Look, I've got trees and all sorts growing through my warehouses. I'm not happy about that. So I might actually look into that. So I'll get these deleted maybe and look into I think there's a mod where I can own the land and it will stop um, them building on it. And hopefully I can try and encourage them to build this way because I'd love this bit here to be filled. This would be nice if it's filled because you've got this tube station here. We've got this station here and we have this here. So if we can get this filled, that would be really nice. But we'll see what happens, I guess. Um, but today, Wembley Park. So I've had a good look at Wembley Park. Um, like I said in the previous episode, we have... I, I'm going to have to... Hmm, it's going to have to go right here. I've had a good look at Wembley Park. And what we seem to have, which we seem to have back here somewhere obviously i've just got a little turn back here so we, we you know I'm, I'm, I'm kind of looking at building the line from here back here somewhere we have almost some um yeah london underground tube services um in terms of servicing the the stock and what how that joins the track is there's some um is it a grade separated junction just before wembley park so i'm gonna try and start some of that today that grade separated junction just because i think I, I'm, I'm not the the I mean, we haven't got the space, so it's going to be a little bit closer. But I'm taking a look at this, and I, I think I could do some sort of mini version of those, that, that, those sidings and those... Is it called uh, Neesden London Underground uh, Train Depot? So we could do a mini version of that, I think. And I think I'd probably... Do, I'd, 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 I'd probably today will get the grade separated junction in and just have the line sort of connected, and then I'll work on that in a detail in episode uh, with some music, and I can just chill and do it, and then show you guys as I'm doing it, and we can get a good look at the end. There's also a great separated junction after Wembley Park, and that's because we end up with these. We've got the Chilton line here, which is fine, because that just sort of curves away and goes bypasses. But what we have is we, we end up with... I, I'm assuming this is up, down, fast, and slow for um, Metropolitan line. And obviously, the way... The way the Met metropolitan line is is it's either side of the jubilee so what happens what has to happen is is it splits into two more lines and up and it splits into an up down slow i'm guessing an up down fast and the jubilee obviously goes this way so the grade separate junction is to get the two tracks on the right hooked up to this because they are either side of the jubilee in here so we've also got to work on that as well it's going to be tight it's going to be areas of slow track. Um, I do have a mod within the um, within the game itself uh, that will, is, which just does me a nice uh, junction um, under over, which is quite which is quite nice. So we will get that done. So basically, let's get started on this. Um, what do I need to do? I need to um, Alt G because I do need the, um, the toolbars up. But first of all, let's get the um, let's get the station in, and we can work either side of it. Then this is the bypassing uh, Chilton. Okay, and then we have two. Then we've got to delete this. And because we can't use our third rail on the platform still, we need high speed with catenary here. And then we need our platforms. Doo -be -doo. There we go. So we need one. This is quite a wide platform. And then we have two more. Yeah. Then we have the. Then we have the. Uh, what's the jubilee in the middle? And then platforms again. And there's actually. I've got to edit. I've just had. I've just had a look, and I've got to edit what I did back there as well. High speed. Two here. Platform. Uh, okay, so we're gonna, we're gonna have to nudge along one anyway. Okay, never mind, because we've gone too far wide. I think I've 
disabled i think going through the mods i've disabled my um my uh unlimited stations mod where i can just go as wide as i like so anyway i wanted to move down a little bit anyway so we're going to delete this i'm going to shuffle this all along and i'm probably going to edit this out a little bit guys i'm not going to lie just for you i think in this game deleting things when you've got to move something that you've built because you've done it wrong is the most painstaking thing in this game double on this then tracks high speed one more time i don't know why it just always seems to be quite painful and then a single platform there that's why so then we can fit all this in and then i need to at some point log back in and find out why uh, I've, un I've i've well i know why because i was trying to fix my track right okay so we've got yeah so we've got up met down met up down jubilee all right let's build this uh station out a little bit so the reason why i did this is because we've also got right i'm going to build the what we're going to do is actually i'm going to build the connections to the platforms i think because it's so we have stairs so i need uh i need uh this because i need this here maybe yeah right on the end of that there and then opposite side there is where we're going to have connections we might even have a small building right okay i've got a, i've got a, a, a mega plan here so we can have that there that there and we're gonna have buildings there and then we've also got oh my god so we've got that's a mini kind of connection a mini so we've got we've got a lot of connections to this there and then i want extended overpass as well here because we also have another building attached to that there and then the other side we've got a little building where did i put that there didn't i so actually that can go away and we can just have a build in there that's fine okay so passenger buildings so we're going to go with these modern german buildings because they seem to work for almost anything so we can have a a small main building here with some office shops there and then we've got a rather large we'll go for a rather large it's a bit more of a fancier building this is it's an angle but we'll just put that on there like so and then on the other side we will have a what's this media without entrance we need one with entrance what's this without without entrance with shops without entrance without entrance without entrance is anything got an entrance with entrance doors right okay that'll do us and we'll have this about there and they are pretty much i think let me just have a quick look they are our yeah there are connections so there are entrances now we need some stairs which we have to go with uh uk let's see and we've got these stairs these stairs are nice and covered but we we just don't have that so what we're going to work with is we're going to work with this we have that there then is that is that does that even that doesn't even connect yeah it does there is a it doesn't it literally does not and it's not going to go the distance there is it not unless i maybe no not that there one there i do that there we go and that and they are facing the wrong way wonderful start again We want them facing this way. There we go. So one there. This one connects to that one. And that one. We'll do these double. Like so. Doesn't connect to that one, which is very odd. And then we have a rather large. So we have, okay. So we have. And then here. This is all underground. This is all underground because it's like it's next. It's the buildings next to a road, but we just we can't do that. Not unless we put a nice fancy bit of roof over some of this. That goes all the way along, and then we also have another set of stairs. We'll do some smaller set, like so here. And I guess that's for direct access on that one, like that. Beautiful. Then we'll go for some station. I wonder if that 
would work if I put attach that to um, Marleybone and we had a direct link. We'll put some seating in. We can't really see much now because it's all got stairs everywhere, but we'll do this. Just a little bit of seating, like so. Put a little bit there as well. And then we need some roof. Um, and it's kind of grey. We'll go for this UK. Here. Here. No, I don't like that. Is there anything I can use better than this? Is there anything more? Will this go over the top, though? See, I'd like to use this, but your sims are going to be poking through the roof. What's this? Basement with stairs. What? Hmm. Interesting. The, um... They're going to be poking through the... Not as we use the proper... See, that's not even tall enough, really, is it? See, these stairs are so tall on these NLs. Which is a real shame. Uh, <laughs> shame that they're so tall. Right, for now, we go for this. So we're covered all the way along here. And to here. And then we are covered to this connection. And that is it. I think that's all we're... Yeah, and then we'll put a little bit of covering on this building here. And I believe that is our Wembley Park. That is huge, isn't it? That is a big station, right? That is a big station. Right. What I'm going to do here is I'm going to have to do some deleting. And we're going to have to do some deleting of this. And we're going to pause the game so you don't rebuild. But we're going to do this side first. So what we have... You know what? Actually, I bet I could use this as a guide to go this way a little bit hold on yeah so this this curves away that way uh high speed no catenary because i think this might be a good guide to where we need to go yeah this is going to be awfully tight that needs to be in a cutting Holy bananas. Oh my god. This is going to be some curve. Right, okay. Back up. Right. So we're going to leave that there. And that's going to just start to come this way, I think. There. Like so. And you're going to be level. And you're cutting. And you're going to be behave yourself and stay like that. Then we need third rail. And you are going to join your little pal. Oh, we've got a bridge as well, right there. Okay, we need to put that bridge in, really. We should have done that a bit further back. All right, hold on. Delete, delete. I'm going to get a road bridge in here. Um, It's a normal one, so that's nice. It's not too big. All right, let's see how you get on. Ooh, lovely. Okay. Uh, track high speed again because we're back on that fix that so I actually think this is more of a stone or concrete bridge have we got a concrete we do right on the end here somewhere don't we right yeah we'll work with that that's quite nice yeah oh it's more it's not really stone it's more steel with like railings but I quite like that okay and then we have right and we've got our so this is kind of a little bit separated actually no we're, we're gonna we're gonna wang this uh, side by side with this third uh, we're not going to mess about with this too much here because it's going to get far too complicated otherwise and you're going to go like that get you swinging past there and next to this because then what we need to do is get this across you're going to go straight even though you're you're all slightly more close. Actually, you might work better. Right, let's get this level first. We'll start. And then coming across here. Why is that not so... That should be the same, right? That changed 
has changed debt. It has. Right, okay, so then what we'll do is this. Hmm. Oh, I want this. I want this coming away. That's the problem afterwards. So if we. Oh dear, delete the road. What a plonker. What a plonker. Get back in there. Delete that. Okay, that's better. Because I want that. Top to that. Ooh. Onto that. Should we do a little bit of road? A little bit of rail there. And then you can go like this. Like this. Right. And then I need to do a track construction. So this is going to be actually what I'm going to do actually first. Where are you going? You're going all the way. Okay, we can we can do this. We can do this. I have a I have a plan. Right, you, we're gonna hook you up. That's a hill and a half, isn't it? Coming up there. Then third. Right, we're we're gonna do our own version of this. It's gonna have to be. So this is gonna have to have a. Track construction now it's this and I want it to be angle crossing needs to be this way. I think. No, it needs to be the other way. So we need to go like so. But then uh I want the height to be nine. third rail why is it rem even though i've disabled i've disabled all this track but it seems to have just hung around concrete third rail okay and then i need to upper track radius i want to start bending that away and then lower track radius I need to come around this corner but that is slightly that's a nice position I think what we need to do is I need to tracks third. Just pop this this way a little bit more. Not that far. Maybe about there on the level. It's still a bit far, isn't it? It almost needs to be just to start coming away. There we go. Maybe there. I don't want it to come away too far because I want this to be as smooth as possible. Let's try track construction now. I can do that. So what I need to do here, as I know this messes about a bit, is I just need to lower that. And then we can build up around it afterwards. Beautiful. Okay. Whew. And then hopefully, you know what? That's not bad, is it? Right, and then that needs to be that. And then that can be our bridge. Now, where is that bridge that we just used? Is this one? Yeah. That's not bad. That is not bad at all. Not bad at all. I can deal with that. I'm quite happy with that, actually. And then this is our Jubilee that's going to just bugger off up here so we'll leave that, that that gradient actually that can just slope up a little bit and then you my little friend gonna come up here a nice nice gonna be oh, whoa a nice gradient then come up That looks quite nice, actually. We can put some retaining walls around that. And around we go. Into that. I can't believe I got that done. I'm, I'm rather... Um, I'm a little bit proud of that, to be fair. Not going to lie. Not bad. Not bad. Not a big fan of that wiggle there. Other than that. I know in real life that this bridge is really close to this, but because of the lack of space and we've got to get that junction in, it's just never going to happen. So that's the way we're having it. 
Right. We've also got, like, after the station somewhere here, there's also literally some sidings. It's no, no, forget it. Forget it. No. Never going to happen. I'm, I'm, I'm so pleasantly surprised that I've got this in, to be fair. As well as I have. Coming out the other side is where it gets a bit... A bit interesting. So we have... Oh, I'm not sure. Right, let's... We've got to delete this for a start. Because it's become obsolete. I think what we need to do first and foremost is put in the Chilton. Because the Chilton's kind of just existing. And it will give us kind of a base as to about where we are going with this. See, I think that's not bad. It's not a bad curve on the hill. Getting us up the hill as well. What, what gets interesting is then we have like uh, it's on the other lines we have a, a a sort of grade separate junction but even that's not see that comes up and it just adds another little line into there Ooh, i don't know what to do with this really okay yes i do come on be strong be strong julian right okay so this one third yes can follow this all the way up to to it this one can just follow it all the way up and just pop itself in there that's fine this is the one that gets interesting so this one kind of comes out and we're gonna wrap that around like that and it, i don't want these at different level because we're on a slope it's gonna be really hard to work this is that that's not the level we're going is that the, the no that looks okay because what i've got to get in here is one of these or oh, maybe if i did this alongside this so it's one underneath so we have let's count our tracks one lower track three uppers cross the angle is that oh no, that's broken now so is that okay crossing angle is not that it's the other way around And it's kind of like this, but our lower track radius is this way. Oof, this is going to be tight. Can we get that any tighter? Woo! That is it, though. That is the one. And then we've got a pop. So this is going to be a lot bigger. Why? In real life, they make things so, so much tidier, don't they? Why can't we go lower? Get lower. Okay, so basically what I need to do is here is tracks, this, this, I think three, this, this, I think that's, that's going to have to be a, a, the amount of space I need. And then track instructions, then this, come on, please, please, please. Pillar collision. That's still going to be tight. Am I going to get that up there? Right, let's have a try. Let's have a try. Am I going to get that up there? I don't think I am. I think this is going to be far too tight. <gasps> right, but, and then could we go straight? Can we go straight up? No. no. Of course we can't. Too tight. Another bit of track. Delete. Building. Track construction there and then track here up we go to there see th even that's <laughs> because what also happens here is you have a i mean i could do that actually that's fine there we go that's actually worked out all right okay fair enough and this is the jubilee which goes into there. And then we have this one can come up with this. And then it joins this. And then another one comes out alongside this up to about here. And then we have a we'll have a switch here. 
And I think then this goes round. Round this somewhere. That's still going down, isn't it? A little bit higher than that. And that is for the sidings. Now, let me just check. And then coming out of here. So then we have a switch on the Jubilee from left to right. And then we also have a switch over to this one. And then another switch before that goes away. Why is that left to right? You'd think that'd be right to left on that. Okay, no, because what happens is, is on the Jubilee as well, is that. That's not bad, there's no... Yeah, that's okay. <clears throat> there's no sort of... I don't want any glitchy bits of track, that's all. That looks okay. And then we can put some retaining wall up on the side of this here, I guess. God, all of this for like, it's not even a major sort of track, really. Why is that curved? Have I not? Oh, come on. I don't want that curving. That needs to be straight on the top of that. There we go. Because what we're also going to get is a different slope coming down. Is that all right there? Yeah. We're going to get a different slope connection with these three. Because they've they started higher. So we're gonna have to do our own sort of Yeah, we're gonna have different we're gonna have different slope levels. We're gonna have to get this all a bit a bit fancy here. Can we just have that as land? Yeah, we ours looks loads different to what it does in real life because because of the space permitting and the abilities of the game and the terrain. In an ideal world I should have leveled off through this terrain, maybe. But then we still would have had some sort of sharp. See, that's, there's a weird, I'm going to have to come and revisit this. Because there's a weird bump in the track here as well, which I'm not a big fan of. That's smooth enough. That one pops into there. That one pops into there. And that one pops into there. And there we have it, guys, I guess. Um, what we're going to have to do is, is, what are we going to do, guys? What are we going to do? Okay, I'm going to tell you. Right, so we're going to add some roads to this. I've done that bridge there. I'm going to have a look see if there's any more bridges. Um, I'm going to do another episode, some detail with some music, some music on the, along the side and a bit of a time, time lapse for you. We'll work out some sort of services here where we've done this little uh, junction. Uh, we'll get some services running on this, see if it works okay. I'm going to go through it again, though. I'm, I think I'm going to go through it, look at, sort of clean up any bits of track, put some fencing up and make it look a bit prettier. Um, you know, make it look like it's meant to be here because at the moment it's looking a bit wild and a bit of a roller coaster through here. But other than that, I'm pretty happy with it. Um, yeah, so I'll do that in the detailing um, and what we'll, we'll see what we do. I guess I'll plop a, a town or something here. I'm going to have a look in the Steam Workshop, see what we got for Wembley Stadium. It's going to be tight. The best option maybe out for Wembley Stadium is about here. If not a bit deeper or here. Um, or here. I don't really know. We've got, we could put something in there, I guess. We'll work it out. Maybe I'll delete this bus stop and do it here. And then what I'll do is I'm definitely... The more and more I look at this, we are definitely not going to get another railway across that. So we'll do a little split off off the Chilton here and just a, a direct turnaround small Wembley station. Station. And we'll have to miss out a whole rail line that leads out of London, which is a shame, but we're just not going to get it. We're not going to get in. We're not going to fit it in. I need to accept it, accept my fate and let it go. Anyway, guys, thank you very much for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe. I really appreciate it. See you guys later.